why I am here in the middle of London's Borough Market on Super Saturday of the Olympics with YouTube's famous Katie Puckrick. Well, famous if you love perfume. I also do a little TV hosting, I do a little writing, and I do a lot of eating, which is why we're here. Why we chose this market. Borough Market is amazing, Amanda. It's been here in some way, shape, or form for at least a thousand years. Wow. So you're gonna take us on a food tour? We're gonna go on a food tour, and the thing that I find whenever I come to Borough Market is it's hard to really know how to pace yourself. You know, you, you gotta stay flexible. You can't just think, um, okay, I'm gonna start with an appetizer, I'm gonna have the main course, I'm gonna have dessert, because you might see dessert first. Look at how, it's just a tower of joy. Talk about anything made with love is healthy. I'm sure fudge is the healthiest because it's made with made so much love. love. Where are we? This is one of my favorite coffee places in London, Amanda. It's called Monmouth Coffee and it is classic British coffee. Outstanding caffeination it's situation. It really is. Cheers. Cheers. Do they have flat whites in America? Because that's when the big thing. When you said flat white here, I did not know what that meant. What is a flat white? It's kind of a cross between a macchiato and a cappuccino, but it's just a slightly creamier foam. The foam is more dense. Dense foam. Yeah. And so it's, it's a also a latte and a cappuccino. Uh, but it's not as milky as a latte. So that's why I say it's more like a macchiato. You know, it's like coffee matte. London, people mostly always hear about Portobello Market. Yeah. Well, Portobello Market is more like uh, antiques, vintage clothes, and uh, record shops, that mm -hmm. kind of thing. Yes. So, Borough Market is all about the food. You can have your pims, you can have your alcohol, you can have your locally sourced food, various meats and various vegetables. And then there's olden days London Southwark Cathedral. And there's always this kind of electricity in Borough Market because, you know, it's food and people just get passionate, excited, and overheated. When you walk into the cheese market, there's like hundreds of cheeses everywhere. How, do we, how did you go about picking what did we end up with? Well, we ended up with something called Ragstone Goat's Cheese. This is like dessert and dinner mixed together because it's savory and it it's and it's also so creamy. Maybe the hit of a, a wine and cheese. Yeah. Do you have some wine? Do we have some wine? <laughs> we are here at the final stop of the day, the pub. Actually, for many British people, it's the first stop of the day. Well. So we don't need to really stand on ceremony, pretend like it's the last thing we're going to be doing. <laughs> Katie, thank you so much. You can find more of Katie at katiepuckricksmells.com or fumehead.com. All right, let's go find time. Cheers. Cheers. Team champions of life.